I'm now going to show you how to edit and delete sales credit notes, so customer credit notes on Sage Accounting. You first have to find the credit note that you want to edit or delete. There's a couple of ways to find it. Go to sales and sales credit notes. The sales credit notes screen will appear. You can find the credit note in this list and click on it. I only have one credit note showing. We created one credit note in the previous video, so it's easy to find. You may need to use the search feature. You may need to change the dates up here. But if I click on this credit note, then to the right, a number of options will appear. Two of these options are edit and void. These are the two options we'll be using in this video. Now, alternatively, you can go to the customer's accounts. This is for Aviva. If you can't find the credit note in that list, go to the customer's account, click on the customer, and you should see the credit note appearing on their account. Once again, you may need to use the search feature or change the date. Once again, if I click on the sales credit note, then I can edit and void. Those same options appear. So sales credit notes, and we'll click on it. If I click edit, I can then edit any of the information on this credit note. This screen is very similar to the screen that showed when we raised the credit note, when we created the sales credit note. So if you know how to raise, create a sales credit, credit note, then you should be able to navigate through this screen with ease. We can edit any of the information, such as the customer, the date, the reference, the description, the amount, etc., etc., the ledger account. Let's say the description was wrong. It says credit for invoice 54897. Let's say it's meant to be 5489712. So we've added the one, two. And let's say the amount was also wrong. It should have been 55, not 50. So 50 plus 10 pound tax, VAT is 60. So let's change that to 55. The total is now 66. If I save this credit note, that will be updated. So if we go back to the sales credit note screen, you can see the amount is now 66. If I go to the customer screen and click on Aviva, you'll see the credit note is now 66. It's been updated. I've edited the credit note. A word of warning, if the sales credit note has been allocated to any degree to an invoice, you won't be able to edit most of the information on the credit note. You have to unallocate that sales credit note first and then you can delete uh, delete it or edit it. So you can't delete or edit a sales credit note unless it's fully unallocated. It can't be allocated to any degree. I'll show you how to unallocate and allocate sales credit notes in the next video. Okay, so how do we delete a sales credit note? Once again, find the credit note, click on it. Those options to the right appear. Instead of clicking edit, I'm going to click void. So I can put in say product returned on 07 10 2025. And then maybe someone's initials, that's me, Sam Morton, the bookkeeping master, click void. The credit note will then be void. And you can see that in the status here. So the credit note is still appearing in my sales credit note screen. If I refresh it, you can see it's still showing here, but the status is void. How does it look on the customer's account? Go to Aviva and you can see it's no longer showing on the customer's account. So that's how to delete and edit sales credit notes or customer credit notes. 